Okay, so when you cut a sprinkler line, you can see here's the pieces. First thing we do is we widen the area so that we can get our saw in here and make a cut, a nice clean cut on both sides. That being done, next you need a rag and you clean off your pipe best you can get it. This glue is still going to set up no matter what you do, but if you get it good and clean, it'll help. So with your pipe exposed and cleaned off, let's go ahead and glue up our first pieces here. Important that these pieces go all the way back. We want to make them perpendicular, straight up and down. Here's the tricky part, putting the glue on this fitting. It's trying to get this one to be straight up and down to match up with here because what we're doing is we're making a bridge. You can see the two pieces will set here and then a piece of pipe across there. So next, we're going to glue up our two little risers right here coming up into the next fitting. Good amount of glue. Push it in there all the way down. Same thing on this side. Good amount of glue. Push it into your fitting. We're all set. Hopefully we're at the correct level. You can see we're going to put these two pieces on right here we're going to make a measurement across. So let's do that right now. Remember that you're measuring from the inside of one coupling to the inside of the other coupling. Looks just about right. These are hard to see. There's no line on the outside, but we'll get it. We'll cut it right there on that S. Looks good. If we got the right measurement, this will slide right on here, which it does. Let's go ahead and glue that up. We're going to glue up both sides this time. Slide it onto your pipe. Push it down. And we're done. A permanent repair takes about three or four minutes.